Hey folks, Noble Rambler and my daughter Sarah, we're back. Hey. And day six of Stardew Valley Saturday. And we are recording several episodes today. We only have one day a week that our schedules really align like this. So not gonna be able to answer anything from last episode's comments if there if there were any. <laughs> but uh, just to give you a heads up, we'll probably do what do you think, three episodes? A week and do them all or is a Sunday right now recording them all then I'll kind of scatter them through the week as they come out that's that's the assumption at this point so we are in I have got the game paused just so that we can talk but um, I guess we'll get started the goal is to make as much money as we can today so let's make it happen time feels as usual now now yeah. no nope, don't pick up the TV <laughs> So what do we have? Weather report. <clears throat> going to rain all day tomorrow. Now, yesterday it said it was going to be sunny today, if I remember right. And I feel like I am off to the side there. Oh, I just kept running. <laughs> all right, so we are 6 in the morning. Oh, that's loud. Okay. Yeah, loud for me at least, not for you guys. And... I haven't watered in a while. Let's see if I remember how to do that. Stand in the middle and right click isn't doing anything, so it's left click. There we go. And try not to water too many of them twice. Just waste the water in your watering can. But with two of us, I uh, we can uh, we can get the watering done more quickly, which is helpful. Now you can't water the space you're standing on, right? You can. You can? Mm -hmm. Oh, I've been moving around. Now, I've clicked that three times and haven't got water in anything. Mm -mm. There we go. Oh, picked a parsnip. I think that's what those were. Mm -hmm. Okay, so do we have any more seeds at the moment? I'm going to go ahead and water this space even though there's nothing there because we're going to drop a seed in it today. In fact... I'll let you go off and buy seeds. I'm going to just work on farm plots and whatnot today and try to get this going. Oops, I usually set up threes because eventually I'll drop a sprinkler in the middle of each one of those. And you could put them all together and just have a sprinkler every third space. That's fine, but I don't know, it just looks better to me. Um, there, there. Now, can you un... With Hoe the, the ground? For the pickaxe. Pickaxe. Okay. <laughs> Not that it's necessary, but someone's going to say, you know, that bothers me. Can you go <laughs> fix that? So I'm just getting ahead of you. But let's set up more. Let's, the assumption we're going to fill all this soon with plants. Now, of course, that's going to wipe out my... There wipe out my energy real quick. I'm already down low on that bar. So I'm going to remind myself how to make the stack bars that I have talked about every episode but not done anything with. It was pine cones. Uh, <clears throat> all three seeds. All three seeds. Ah, okay. Which means a lot of tree chopping to make them. So in the end, can you gain seeds fast enough to overcome the energy you lose to chop down the trees? Or is it a is it a loss? I don't think so. I think okay. it's pretty rare to get seeds. Anyway, E crafting field snacks. You guys go there and deposit the don't chop the box. <laughs> deposit the rest of the goodies in there and go fill up my watering can. And it's already ten forty in the morning. <laughs> fill up the watering can. There we go. And I'll water just a few more of these. We've got 13 potatoes coming. Okay. So grab this one here. Here's nine of them. It's all a matter of timing your clicking. I click twice and nothing happens. That's because it hadn't finished the animation yet. Now, what was the deal with how do you get a dog? Someone that brings them by? Yeah, it's... Over time, I forget which day, but Marnie will show up with a pet. Marnie, that's right. She sells all the farm animals. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, I'm going to go 
make some more seeds. So is there any more seeds within our farm? I'm going to just clear this area out here. There we go. Yeah, let's clean out these trees first. That's... The hole looks a lot like an axe. Always mixing those two up. Mm -hmm. And we'll go ahead and clean out the grass in this place. Normally, if we were dealing with a farm nearby, I would leave all this and we'd make hay out of it. But, and let's... Actually, there's something else we could do today. Let's, I'm going to grab one of my field mm -hmm. snacks. Right click, left click. Um, just out on the screen. We'll right click, I think. Eat. Yes. There we go. Watch my energy hardly move at all. <laughs> Let's do another one of those. All right. So that keeps me going longer into the day. But um, I also want to go over and to the area where the grass is growing, clear that out so that it can be maturing and expanding. So that when we get to that point, we already have hay ready to go. And I'm still learning my way around this map. So that is down in here. More chance for seeds. That's what we'll call it. And as your axe proficiency goes up, it's... No, it'll only just take more or less energy. But to get a better axe, it will take less strikes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, let's clean this area out. Try to get just the weeds and not the grass up in there. And that is a little tree, but we'll take him out too. And I can't tell. There, we have a stone in there. Hiding behind the tree. Look up. There we go. So you clear out the ground and the... I'm out of room already. And the uh, grass will be able to expand and grow. So we'll make a grassy field in here, turn that into hay later. And then our animals will be up in, in fields up in this area. Mm -hmm. So that's that's the game plan. Okay, grab you. That is wood hiding up in there. There we go. Um, let's take this tree out. You can see better. <clears throat> My inventory is full. It is freaking out over here. Yeah. Can't wait till we get the better backpack, but I just saw something there. There's another pathway. Let's clear this area out. Inventory being full isn't a loss. Your, the items will stay there. So I'm not throwing things away that I know of. Mm -hmm. The last episode, I threw away some good bonuses. <laughs> Let's go empty this backpack. Um, and in case some of you missed last episode, we do have a mod going that allows us to slow time down a little bit so I can spend more time narrating and talking and not have my entire day gone, even though <clears throat> it's now, well, I, I, I suppose something like twice as long of a day it still runs out really fast. There's a lot of grass up in this area already. Hmm. Is this where we should be doing this instead? What happens down here? What do we want uh, to do in this area? It could be more farming. Can we... I guess once we get sprinklers, we can handle more farming, but mm -hmm. that sounds a little overwhelming right now. Yeah. So, okay, then maybe I'll just clear this area out a little bit. What have we got here? A hoe or a scythe. Let's go to this guy. And <clears throat> the only stone? The only stone. Okay. Take you out. Take a tree out. Okay, we'll get the grass growing in this area. We'll have to clean out some of it for uh, putting buildings in. But if we can get the silo in first, then we won't not we won't be wasting it. It'll be turned into hay. If I, if I remember right, Robin can't put a building down unless you've cleared the uh, the the landing spot right. footprint. And I'm out of energy. Yeah, me too. So let's throw together... Nope, I don't have enough. I'll get some more field snacks. Let's toss the coal, toss the stone, toss the... Now I've got to move. E. If you get me out of here. Click outside of your inventory, you should toss it. I don't want, really want to toss it. I wanted to turn the screen off. 
Oh. I wanted to go over to these seeds before I collect threw any more out to replace it with something that was useful. There we go. So now I can go in and make us a couple more field snacks. One more. <laughs> Toss you in there. And... Oh, I thought I had one left already. Oh, well, never mind. I was going to make us both one. That didn't happen. The day's over anyway. <laughs> oh, these short days. <clears throat> I really enjoyed playing Minecraft. Haven't done it for quite a while, but those short days just drove me insane. <laughs> it's the same length, 10 minutes or so to, of a day. And mm. Oh, I'm out. So I can't get, do it. Okay, I'm just going to have to... Oh, I hate to waste a field snack, but I'm not going to use it. We'll just mosey our way on up and over. <laughs> <laughs> so, you can go sell anything you want to, or... Yeah, I got them. Okay. I'm just going to act like a slow old cowpoke. Bow-legged, just got off my steed. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, once you run out of energy down there, it drops you to a crawl. You can't walk anymore. You can't run. All right. Yes, please. So what did we get for the day? <clears throat> Got 130. Not much, but it, it grows gradually. All right, so any uh, bonuses? So on Sundays, if you watch your TV, you can learn a new recipe. Okay. Now, can you as well? Yeah, I'll have to do my own. Okay. So Queen of Sauce. So you eventually will have your own expanded house. and mm -hmm. ah. So the Queen of Sauce. Greetings. It is I, the Queen of Sauce, here to teach you a new mouth-watering recipe with my secret cookbook. This, this week's dish... Stir fry. Mmm. It's a perfect way to get some healthy greens on your plate. Saute the greens in a little. Oh, if I, I wish I could do a Julia Child impersonation. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah. A little sesame oil and make sure to add plenty of fresh ginger and garlic. Now breathe deeply. Oh, that's good. <laughs> and if you right click on your fireplace, you can turn some lights on. Okay. So when you go in at night, it won't be so dark. And does it cost you any fuel or anything? Nope. Uh huh. So it's just, just for, for make believe. Mm -hmm. Weather report. Tomorrow will be beautiful, sunny. Today will be rainy, if I remember right. Mm -hmm. So no watering crops. Good. Mm -hmm. So, why don't you go turn that into three more potatoes? And I'm going to just finish off the last of these guys here. Now that have a little bit of energy. You have to wait till. Now, is Pierre open on Sunday? Yes. Just so, it's just Wednesday. Wednesday. Okay. Uh, grab that one, run over here. Let's finish cleaning up that upper, oh, we'll call that the cow pasture. Cows on that side and chickens on the other. Of course, we'll, it will be, cows are later. A bit. Yeah, it's goats. No, what is, mm. oh, chickens are the very first, right? Yeah. But what's the first other animal? Yeah, At that point, it's all of them? Cow is first for barn. I think then like sheep, then goat. Okay. But barn's more expensive. <clears throat> Oh, that's right. Barn meaning a bigger level than than the coop. Than the coop. And eventually, you get ducks for the coop. Mm -hmm. And rabbits. Ah. So you have a few things you can donate to the community center, and a couple of things for the museum if you want to do that today. Okay. They're all in the chest. Okay. My inventory's full. Can't pick up the pine cones. Pangos are what I wanted. Um, I'll eat my... Wow, I'm out of energy again. <laughs> mm. Okay, fill snack, yes. Now I can pick up the pine cones. And I can make more field snacks. Let's grab these. Nope, can't even do that. So, I have to run outside here. 
Okay, so let's make a couple of those and stock up energy for the day, then, then I'll go and do what you just suggested. So there, I still can't. What do I need? I need that one seed over there. Hmm. And if I toss the wood, won't I just pick it right back up again? Mm -hmm. So I've got a... Oh, is that a seed there? I can't tell if that's hiding in there. Just... I toss you... There's the seed. Okay, mm -hmm. toss the wood over there. Grab the other seed. Uh, maple seed, we'll call it. And try this one more time. There you are. I can only make one. Grumble. <clears throat> well, let's grab this wood, bring it over there, and swap out in the... That's not a wood. Well... <laughs> It's not a wood I can pick up. So I need to go over the top of your place to get to mine rather than go down underneath. Okay. I was also thinking, you know how we have a little fenced in yard at the very top left? Eventually I might move my house into there and have my own little yard. Where are we? The, so over top left. So up here. Up here. Yeah. No, <clears throat> down a bit. This could be my, my house. Oh, I thought this was the then animal coop. Underneath here we have the animals. Oh, down here. Okay. Yeah, yeah okay. That, that's a good idea. <laughs> so we'll put the horse here, maybe. Yeah. Now, can we get more than one horse? I don't know. Good question. Something just... <laughs> <laughs> Something just howled at us. <laughs> All right. Get in there. Drop off that, that, that. Pick up. That, that, and what is the other seed that I'm missing? Pinecone. Pinecone, okay. And make some more, two, well, three more of those. And here, I'll drop two of those in there for you. And what am I looking for now? E. Tool, make three of those, do that. Okay, now... It's already noon, but it's dark, but it's the uh, um, it's the rain. So you now so that minimum... geodes need to go to Clint. Clint, <clears throat> and we need twenty-five gold. They're so. all going to pause or going to close before I get there, right? <laughs> need twenty-five gold. We don't have it yet, but I could sell off. Uh, I could just sell off these guys. Well, actually, your spring forgeables go to the community center. So those, um, those two that you just took and the horseradish, you can... But we'll get more. Yeah. I can get 25 gold for the day to go and pop open a geode. Sure. Okay. We'll get more of those. We also... So this goes to the museum, mm -hmm. and I can't fit it now. I guess toss the watering can for the day. And that goes to the museum. Mm -hmm. And we'll have him... I didn't even get my geode. Oh, okay. We can also stock up geodes. Okay. Just do them all at once. But while I'm out there, I'll show one time how it's done. Mm -hmm. So if I'm going to the museum anyway. But I need to pause. <laughs> they close at 2, right? No. the uh, uh, Clint is 4, I think, and the museum is like 5 or 6. Okay. I'm still going to pause a little bit there. <clears throat> Spent so much time talking. Seems only fair. Mm -hmm. Now, I do have room for these guys if I find any more. Otherwise, let's run over here, sell those, get up to 25, go break open a geode so we can show how that works, and then go to the museum and drop some things off. I'm never going to get the E in the right click straight. So let's talk to Pierre. Um, really? 30, 40, and 50? That's quite a bit. I didn't expect to get that much. Okay. So, <clears throat> in that case, let's grab one more potato. That leaves me with 32. I can get one more potato. Okay. Now I'll drop you in there. And run back out. Get over to these before the screen gets any darker. And, um, yeah, I'll grab the garbage can. <laughs> I was about to say, if I accidentally get something, then I may not have room for what comes out of the geode. So the geode, Clint will crack it open, and something inside will be a bonus to us. So here's Clint, and let's process a geode, that particular geode. He's moved over to his, his anvil there. He's going to 
crack that thing open. Boom. And we got five little pieces of copper out of that. Copper ore. I hear the rain under his roof. <laughs> so we got copper ore out of that. Do we keep it? Oh, there it is over there. Okay. Okay, run out of here, run down to the museum. And we'll turn time back on. Now that I know we're not going to miss this. And a new cutscene. <laughs> Though while I'm cutscening... I'm still playing. You're still playing. Is time still going? Mm -hmm. Ah, these take a while. Abysmal, that's what I say. <laughs> not a single piece in the entire collection. <clears throat> Yet take all the time you want. The video's almost over. What's this? Oh, you found something. Let me see it. Oh, which one did I find? The chicken? Remarkable. It's very old. I'd love to study this in greater detail. But it is yours. Hmm. I've got a favor to ask of you. Would you consider donating any new artifacts or minerals that you find? We could make a groundbreaking discovery together. So, Colonel Custer voice. <laughs> yeah. Uh, uh, Kentucky Fried Chicken, mm -hmm. that that dude. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, and and who knows? If you keep donating, I might come across some interesting items to send your way. All right. Not all right. Think about it, will you? If you decide to donate, just bring the objects to the front desk. Ah. Can you uh, head over to the front desk, please? I've got something to donate. There we go. I got a donation to make. I found this peculiar chicken. Oh, I have to place it. That's right. I wanted to go right there. And Gunther can tell you more about this if you donate it to the museum. So we'll put you down over here. Okay. And now, if I remember right, I can walk over to them and click on them and find out what the heck is this chicken. So, chicken statue. <clears throat> it's a statue of a chicken on a bronze base. The ancient people of this area must have been very fond of chickens. <laughs> uh -huh. Neokite. The delicate shards form a tiny pink meadow. Meadow? Did I read that, read that right? Meadow. Okay. Poetic. Yeah. I have a different definition of the word meadow than... <laughs> And there were two books there I could have read. <laughs> okay, day's not entirely over. And I have some space, so I'm going to run down to the... the. Uh... We need to bring some wood over here. Oh, yeah. Probably have enough now. <clears throat> yeah, why don't you bring the wood over while I wander over here. And mm. there, Two days in a row, there's nothing to get. You haven't been to the beach? No. Huh. It's not every day. Kind of disappointing. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Yeah, I'm going to run in circles. Let's see if we can get an interaction with this thing. We cannot. Just something to look at at this point. Okay, so where are you? I'm up north in the mountain. Oh, so you're, not, oh you're okay. running back to get. Well, we'll talk to Sebastian. The ocean is, the, is best enjoyed alone, don't you think? <laughs> yeah, and you're going to tell it to me twice. Okay. <laughs> Strange how for some of them, you can't get another response out of them. Okay, I guess I just missed my timing on you. You just left your store. If you purchase a high-quality fishing rod, you'll be able to attach bait and tackle to the line. Bait causes fish to bite faster. Tackle can make your job a lot easier when reeling in fish. And, yeah, you just left. <laughs> hmm... All right, so where are you at now? I'm heading over. You're heading over, weird. and I'm just going to wish that I could light this campfire. <laughs> and there you are. Okay. Yeah. So I'm going to drop off 300 or more or so wood, maybe. Yay. Boom. There it is. All right, so we can run across here and find nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, we have a scary man in the top. That's but fine. we do have the one... What are those guys? Uh, sea urchin. Sea urchin. And uh, 
he scare me. <laughs> old Mariner, I've got this old amulet to sell, but something tells me you're not ready for it, lad. You know how long I went up to him to get that same message before I finally, <laughs> finally figured out what that meant? <laughs> so that has to do with, with marrying someone. But you have to already have a good, strong relationship with someone before he's going to even give you the time of day. <laughs> All right, no one's there to say, yuck, don't pick up my garbage. Oh, but uh, he just might. This is Alex. Hey. Ah, <laughs> oh, nice talking with you. What, you want to talk to me? I'm busy. He's the local jock. Okay. Um, I am out of money and time. Can't get into the store, but there is an exclamation point. Ah, both here and over there. Help wanted. I'm looking for someone to bring me 25 copper ore to aid in the understanding of local minerals, Clint. No, I'm not going to commit to the uh, to the mine just yet. Oh, I can get in here. Oh, mm. not for the store, though. Mm -mm. Just to go and meet... That's not Abigail. Who is that? Caroline. Caroline. But I'm kind of going into their private home to do it, and that always feels weird. So I'm going to, nah, I'm going to say no. It's a very but, friendly town. Yeah, just leave their doors open. Now I'm going to fight this, uh, oh, I already did that, yeah. Never mind. <laughs> it was this one I was looking for. Journal. So, done, archaeology. 250 gold. We have missed out on all those bonuses last time. All right, so Gunther's happy about getting things brought to the museum and hit this one. We have a rat problem. Uh, there's something odd going on in the community center. Yeah, we saw those weird rats last time. Explore the mine. There's an old mine shaft in the mountain north of town. There could be valuable minerals inside, but Marlin hinted that it might be dangerous. Okay, reach level five. That takes a while. So... Nothing more for me to really do out here. You can go up to the community center to finish that quest. If you go back in, it'll, that'll be your rat problem. Oh, okay. And then tomorrow we can turn that money into a bunch of seeds. Um, playground. We didn't see this last time. And every once in a while there's stuff up in here to go and find. Especially when we get to berry season. Mm -hmm. There are berries on all the, uh, a whole bunch of these bushes. And I like to stick them up in places that it takes a lot of walking to get to. So, rat problem. So, let's walk over here to this room, the future room of, I forget. <laughs> <laughs> and it's Garvaldy Guck. Okay, so we have a secret message. And we That's didn't all. pick it up. Nope. Mm -hmm. And then we head over to Mr. Wizard. <clears throat> I think tomorrow he'll send you a letter. Ah, spoiler alert. <laughs> Otherwise, yeah, Alex is just guarding that garbage can. <laughs> I'll, uh, I'll head down this way home. Because there's another garbage can down here. <laughs> oh, did I get something there? I did not. Okay. Oh, I did. Trash. Cool. But you you can sell trash in this town and still make a little bit of money. In the bin. If I remember right. <clears throat> anyway, you been down here yet today? Uh, no. Okay, let's grab the spring onions. There we go. Now, well, I guess there's probably no way to prove it. If you don't pick them, will they be there the next day? Will it build up, or will they despawn and new ones spawn in? I don't remember. So is there any advantage to waiting and doing it once every few days? Mm. Doesn't seem like it would be, but... Um, I'm going to run around, I guess, with my... Hmm, so that's a shame. I can't pick that up. Nothing I really, well, I could toss the trash. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's see. E, toss you, toss it in the trash, or I can just leave it on the ground and and careful not to walk into it again. There we go. Diagonal through here. 
run around with a pineapple on my head, pretending it's a horseradish. <laughs> and I can't pick you up, so I guess I'm just running home. I was hoping for more horseradish. <clears throat> Um, no, I can't do stone or wood or anything. If I already had them in my backpack, then I'd be able to. Yeah, yeah this studio does get warm. This, uh, this new graphics card. I was joking <laughs> with, uh, with Ve about that. We are talking about it, because, oh, uh, when I first got this, it was still summer. This, graf this new graphics card. And so this studio gets really warm. And running that and playing a game... It easily hits 90 degrees in here, so we're joking together that uh, you know you could we could heat a small apartment with these <laughs> graphics cards. That grew back, so the weeds grow back. Uh, I, yeah. I walked through this thing many times, and I was blocked just then. <laughs> so maybe they grow back when it rains. Well, maybe. Okay, so dump you guys all off. I'll pick up the potatoes, drop off the ore. We have 21 ore already. But it doesn't count toward a uh, a, a challenge or a... Uh, right. Yeah. It has to be fresh that When you day. go to the bulletin board and say, yes, you've got to start from scratch, even though they're already in your hand. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's frustrating. Okay, so potatoes look like these. So I'll put some more right over here. Okay. So potatoes in there, everything's watered. Um, hmm. Can't tap on these guys till you have an upgraded pick. Can't tap on these guys till you have an upgraded axe. Uh, the upgraded hoe allows you to hoe three and five rows at a time. Yeah. Same with the watering can. And upgraded fishing pole, it really isn't. You just buy a better fishing pole. And it then allows you to have a bigger bar that moves up and down, so it's a little easier to keep the fish in the middle of it. Have I got all that right? Mm hmm Okay. And now you have enough resources to make a furnace to complete that uh, oh. quest. Okay. Well, let me finish this and see what's hiding up there. There is a watering trough and a pot. Anything we do with that pot, or is that just decoration? I think it's decoration. Okay. But you can put out your own pots and put plants in them. Mm-hmm. Okay, so, oh, are we, we're still paused. That's why this day has <laughs> never ended. Yeah, we'll, we'll have that happen once in a while. And, yeah, that's okay. So, stone. Stone and copper. And copper. And I still have a space, so E, build this guy, furnace. <laughs> okay, put you in there. And the furnace goes where right now? I usually put that on the, the side of the house until I get a building to put it in. Mm -hmm. I think we'll do that. No rotating, right? No. Okay. Furnace goes there. But you need five ore to test it. Mm -hmm. And one coal. Yes. <laughs> so we have a furnace, but uh, <laughs> I can be able to do anything with it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's drop all you guys off and pick up my watering can for tomorrow. And I can't move you, unfortunately. i got to go out and then move you. Okay, so with that, I feel like I was about to do something. And I can't think of what it was now. Okay. Um, I have enough energy to go bang on a few more trees. What was I going to do? <laughs> you brought up the furnace. And I think you were chopping trees when I said that. Yeah, but there was... Hmm. Oh well. Brain fart. <laughs> Half timers. And we're getting dark again. I try to time when I'm editing, change the uh, the light right when I say I'm getting dark again, so it oh. magically reappears. <laughs> and I'm just hitting nothing right there. Do you lose energy when you hit nothing? You do. Yes. Bummer. Okay. Well, let's swipe through. You get the most bang for your buck when you use the scythe and take out all those at once. And scythe doesn't take energy. Oh! Yeah. That's good to know. Scythe just, and your sword. I'm just going to go scythe the world away. <laughs> kind of fun to say scythe. Of course you... Well, I guess they can see what I'm doing. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> if I'm just scything at things for no reason, you'll know why. <laughs> 
All right, so I pick that guy up and pretend I can see where I'm going. There's something in my way. Let's take him out. Okay. Scythe. Over there. Nope, that's not a weed. All right. I'm hitting that point where I'm not accomplishing anything. Time to call this done. So, one more day, or do we call this episode finished? Uh, how long have we been going? Uh, before I answer that, I don't know. Oh, over there. Uh, 35 minutes. So, that's half hour is probably a decent mm -hmm. episode. So, smelting, use your furnace. <laughs> Step two. Okay, we got to use the furnace. So, that will be maybe tomorrow. We got to find some copper somewhere. So, going to sleep for the night. Yes. If I hit enter, does anything happen? No. So, we got to go over there and do it. So, what did we get today? You remembered to throw some things in the bin. Nice. And you went fishing. Yeah. And if you click on your plus here, oh, you that's can right. See how much they're worth. Right. And so that one sea urchin was 160. And you threw away some gold and silver. Well, we don't need them for anything else. Oh, we don't? Not the spring onions. But you could put them into the, oh, the celebration where you present everything from your farm. Mm, that's not till summer. And I, I think the spring onions are not very high quality anyway. Okay. Alrighty. So we've got that and the fish are worth those prices right there. So largemouth bass. Good job on that <laughs> one. Um. Oh, there were two of them. Mm -hmm. That's why I was going to say, this is worth more. <laughs> but yeah, okay. So done with that. Made some money. Next time we'll buy some more seeds. And we've got to start buying seeds that uh, mature a little quicker soon. Or as we head further toward the end of spring. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, we will not be able to harvest them in time. We'll just have lost them. <laughs> and we're there. So oh, we're going to call this one done. It's been Noble Rambler and Sarah. And we'll catch you next time. Bye. Bye.